Developing today at 5, police say burglars crawl through these holes in the roof of a local Target store. This one is in Barrow County. Now, police believe the crime may be connected to burglaries in other states. Channel 2's Tony Thomas is live in Bethlehem. He has the surveillance video from inside that store. Tony? Javita, Target stores across the eastern seaboard had apparently been on alert since this series of break ins began. The two burglars, though, broke into this store overnight, got in and out before the first shift workers even arrived for work. It's wrong. Not very Christmassy. But Barrow County authorities believe these two cat burglars have had a lot of practice. They're suspected in recent heists in Target stores in West Virginia, Tennessee, and just last week, Macon. This is surveillance video from Tuesday's burglary. Deputies say the two people dropped in through a hole they cut in the roof about 1.50 in the morning. They went in into the bathrooms of the store, and that gives them access to the inside. One of the suspects attacked an ATM, smashing it open to take all the cash inside. The one thing we do know is there is a yellow crowbar and sledgehammer that is being used on the ATM machines. That is common in the different uh, burglaries. Authorities say also common is the hole left in the roof. News Chopper 2 flew overhead as workers began to patch the damage Tuesday morning. It's right here at Christmas time. Yeah. I mean, the stores are usually stocked pretty decent. When Besides the cash, investigators say the burglars stole phones and a drone backpack before they went back to the women's restroom and crawled up through the same hole they came in through. A manager reported the burglary about 3.30 in the morning. Deputies say the thieves were already long gone. Things don't happen here that like that often. Investigators here say they aren't exactly sure how the two thieves cut through the roof in this case. In that Macon case from last week, Bibb County authorities say a chainsaw was used. Live in uh, Barrow County, Tony Thomas, Channel 2 Action News.